a man flies out of a car and i find myself laughing and then one character says sun raha hai na tu aur dusra bolta hai ro raha hu main and i realize ki this this is the kind of comedy that we've been missing for so long hi i am pratiksha mishra and you're listening to my review of madgaon express Kunal Khemu is known for his comedic timing. His just understanding of comedy as a language is very very good and that becomes very evident in his directorial Madgaon Express. Basically Madgaon Express story hai teen doston ki jo Goa ja hi nahi pa rahe hain which honestly is the story of a lot of our lives. Ye teen dost school se lekar jab tak unki jobs lag jati hain Goa ja hi nahi pate hain. Two of them have reached New York and Cape Town also but still have not reached Goa. Finally they somehow make a plan to go to Goa before anybody can stop them and then all hell breaks loose. The three friends are Dodo played by Divyendu, Ayush played by Avinash Tiwari and Pinku played by Prateek Gandhi. Ye tino dost aaram se Golmal universe mein bhi fit ho sakte hain ya Dhamal universe mein fit ho sakte hain and that is kind of what the just the vibes of Madgaon Express are like it feels like a 2000s ke time ka comedy. Arse ho gaya aise comedy dekhe hue screen mein. There are parts where it kind of goes for low hanging fruit like should we really still be referring to the female character as mal and also this whole men cross dressing for comedy thing has also become very very old. Hum shakals is still a nightmare that I live through every day. But still there's some respite I guess to be found in the fact that they don't actually go into very harmful stereotypes and they also don't exaggerate their motions as we usually see people do and that's honestly i know the bare minimum but that's one thing that i should tell you does not happen the best part of madgaon express is the performances all of the performances are picture perfect the entire lead cast does such a wonderful job prateek gandhi plays prateek aka pinku he is essentially this worry ward jo hamesha bag mein medicine leke ghumta rehta he is very worried that his mom is going to yell at him and fully understandable this is the same mom who plays the sass in anupama so i understand where the stress is coming from but ye jo bag hai uska wo station pe ghum ho jata hai and then he realizes that he's picked up a bag that has like guns and cash and just chaos ensues then there's avinash tiwari who with his performance and with the writing flips what we think of the hunk in bollywood cinema unka jo ek charming nature hai and just the way that he plays the role makes him even more attractive my favorite performance comes from divyendu he is a brilliant actor usme to koi shak hi nahi hai and even here he's playing the loser of the group jiski zindagi utni achhi nahi jati hai jaisi uski doston ki gayi hai so he's essentially photoshopping an entire persona just to impress them there is desperation that he has there is this wish to just reach the aspirations that he wants to and there's also the fact that he is genuinely just not a great person aur uska pure time ek bhi redemption nahi hota which is fair kyunki teen din mein koi bhi insaan redeem nahi kar leta hai khud ko and still there's an earnestness in his performance that you see in his character as well where this is just a person who's holding on to his past who's holding on to his past friendships also in madgaon express we see how friendship is genuinely work it isn't ki ye teen dost hai aur jo ek dusre se beintaha pyar karte hain there are no problems between them jo bhi hoga saath mein solve kar lenge in madgaon express we actually see that this is a friendship where there are at times power dynamics in play there are times when the other does not like another person and that happens but at the end of the day they just come together because of the fact that they have a friendship to sustain मड़गांव एक्सप्रेस का बहुत सारे जो कमीडिक बिट्स हैं दे डू लैंड देर आर सम दैट डोंट दैट इज आई गेस द डेंजर ऑफ दिस जॉनरा बट डिस्पाइट दैट इनफ ऑफ द जोक्स लैंड कि आपको कभी भी ऐसा नहीं लगेगा कि फिल्म में एक डल एक्सपेंस है देर आर टाइम्स वेन द पेसिंग सफर जहाँ पे कोई एक गैग है या कोई बिट है या कोई सीन है जो बहुत ही लंबा खिंच जाता है एंड इट लूजेज इट्स कमीडिक चार्म सो इन दोज प्लेस यू विल फाइंड योर सेल्फ feeling a little bit like the film has dulled down kyunki film ke highs itne acche hain pun not intended ki the lows also feel equally as low i also very much genuinely enjoyed nora fatehi's performance in this when it comes to her performance in the song sequences naturally she's great she's a natural on screen when it comes to that but even in the acting there are parts of it that are just so charming that you can't look away from her character her character isn't as fleshed out as the men are and this is a recurring problem in the film in general also the female characters don't get as much due as the male characters do but the performances do enough to kind of sustain themselves in this film aur do characters hain who have been so perfectly cast kyunki in dono ko chhod ke in characters ko koi bhi play nahi kar sakta tha one is kanchan komedi played by chhaya kadam and the other one is the don mendoza played by upendra limai 
a lot of the films kind of idiosyncrasies come from these two characters and these characters are proof ki kabhi kabhi agar koi character fleshed out na bhi ho if the idiosyncrasies are written and performed well you can still make memorable characters that being said chaya kadam does feel very woefully underutilized in this role i remember that in lapata ladies also she doesn't have a lot of screen time but unka role itni achi tarike se likha gaya tha aur unko itni achi tarah se utilize kiya gaya tha ki wo utna khatakta nahi hai yahan pe wo baat zara si khatakti hai There are a lot of parts in Madgaon Express where you kind of sit back and just enjoy the direction. जैसे कि प्रतीक का जो character है in his coke addled not even rage I would say just his coke addled self is kind of an alter ego that is almost a superhero जो बस एक दो कदम दूर है ये बोलने से कि भाई डर क्यों रहा है तेरा भाई संभाल लेगा ना That kind of switch that happens in Prateek Gandhi's performance is genuinely perfect to see on screen, and it's very much the kind of slapstick comedy that you've come to expect from films like Gol Mal, for instance. And then there's just the comedy gang. I think is what they're called in general. Uber stylish. The fashion statement absolutely perfect. I did find myself wondering कि अगर इतना बड़ा gang है, इनको अपने ही weapons चलाने क्यों नहीं आता? I guess it's in service of having that funny scene where someone flies into the background. But still, that was something that I was left wondering. If you're such a ferocious gang, I'm assuming you'll know how to kind of use guns. <laughs> But regardless. this entire fashion kind of extravaganza aside i really wanted to see more of this gang especially since kanchan komri has this very godfather esque way of doing things that was very interesting to me margaon express uses background score very very well it is using background score as a tool also to kind of just spoof other films in general for instance there are parts when a character is very emotional wo bahut hi aise dil se kuch baat kar rahe hain the music becomes very sad in the background only to abruptly stop when someone is like yaar kya bakwas kar raha hai chill <laughs> chill out and then there's that part where i think lakshya ka soundtrack plays in a very emotionally moving scene again to be brought back into reality so rudely and these are the parts where i am genuinely kind of excited to see how this film is playing with background score the camera work itself is also pretty decent nothing to write home about but it does its job pretty well the music in the film is honestly as silly as the film itself and i don't mean that in a bad way it's still enjoyable because you're essentially rhyming words like queen cover with lover and see this this is where you truly put your literature degrees into use this is the kind of rhyming that i expect from films like this margao express is genuinely enjoyable through and through despite some of its flaws and these are flaws that need to be called out because it's mostly there in the writing the low hanging fruit thing genuinely is something that bothered me a lot but otherwise through and through laughter riot i genuinely genuinely lost it when a man fully flew through the car window ये ऐसे कैरेक्टर्स हैं जिनसे आप रिलेट इसलिए कर पाते हो बिकॉज देर आर पार्ट्स यू सी इन देम दैट ओनली योर क्लोजेस्ट फ्रेंड्स हैव सीन इन यू डोंट लाई डोंट लाई टू मी ऑल ऑफ अस हैव डन थिंग्स लाइक दिस एंड आई एम ऑनेस्टली जेलस बिकॉज देयर गोवा ट्रिप एक्चुअली मेड इट आउट ऑफ देयर ग्रुप चैट माइंड स्टिल हैजेंट सो आई गैस एम यूजिंग अ पब्लिक प्लेटफॉर्म टू कॉल माई फ्रेंड्स आउट चलो यार गोवा प्लीज एंड आई जेनुअनली होप दैट आर गोवा ट्रिप डज नॉट गो दिस वे बिकॉज मेरे में इतनी हिम्मत है ही नहीं ये सब करने की All that being said, Madgaon Express genuinely is a very fun watch, and I had the time of my life watching it, and I might even watch it again, which is something I haven't said about a film in a while. And that is why my rating for Madgaon Express is three point five stars out of five.